of waking state that is going on perpetually. Everything <coughs> comes into aliveness the moment sun rises, the whole cosmos, all the five basic elements, they were there in the dark night too. A bird sitting during those dark hours, what is its state, state of existence? almost samadhi, it undergoes samadhi, trance, trance. Eyes half closed, no center within. There is a body sensation of the other bird, the pan, by the side. Sometime smooching each other. What is it that that's going on there? Waiting. Waiting with the trust that the beloved is going to arise. That is the waking state. That is the sun is going to dawn. It is going to be one with the cosmos flying here and there. Without leaving any trail or track in its flight. Nothing to register. Nothing to expect. Nothing to do. Living is playfulness itself. Just flying here and there in search of food. Search of food is not a, an activity. To get the food, it doesn't fly. It flies, it gets something. There is no motivated movement in that. A separate center thinking itself to be Intelligent only creates the center. Throughout our waking state, all our movements are motivated. We don't exist at all without a motive. Is it not our state? Who has tied that motive in us? For each of our moment. And uh, any motive, if, if, if we use the word motive, it is using. What is a motive? Make use of. Make use of the next one hour. Make use of your friend's influence in getting something. Make use of your own acquired skills. Be it within or in the external world. With the things available, with the wealth available, or with the influences or the persons. Every relationship, is it not motivated? What else is that relationship? Tell me. The moment a kid is born as a son in that family, expectations also arise, isn't it? He should carry forward the lineage in whichever way it was going on. society 
influences the kid, including the near kid and kin, right from parents to the teachers, friends, society, everything. And several masks are laid on that center, placed on that center, several masks. Those masks are simply nothing but full of hidden motives. How do we bring, bring up a kid? How do we rear a kid? Do we not uh, lay all our expectations on it? As if uh, you maneuver through uh, your car in a full traffic jam and find your own space and come out of it. In the same way, you have an end in view, a clear purpose. Do we not mesmerize him with that purpose, goal? What are our talking? interactions within our family anything and everything can all these motivations have a Can all these motivations, everything is a motivation, any talk, the whole of the relationship, any, any, any relationship, be it between your uh, children or with your parents or with your, in your employment or in your business or in your profession or a stranger, platform, anywhere across the world, what is it that relationship is? Any gesture through all through all by our senses, what do they seek? What do they seek? Do all these things exist in the animal world right from one amoeba to this? Animal, animal level with five sensory perceptions but without a center, psychological center, egoistic center. Do these things, sir. the motivated relationships, sir. the motivated centers, sir. do these centers exist there? Anywhere in this cosmos, except in a human being, even from a kid. The moment uh, it identifies itself with that name, particular name that has been given to it and that particular form and the mind feeling, mind, she is my mother, he is my father, my father is a policeman and someone of a powerful, influential post are the servants. Some people are born with golden spoon. Is it not a powerful bond on them? Because all around uh, their relationships are fully influenced with conditioned relationships. A small prince of 5 years old will call a 60 years old man by name, right? If he is born with a golden spoon. You can see. You can see. He will call by name. If at all the respect was given to that being, that old man, by the elders, 
it will be imbibed in this kit also otherwise otherwise what rules there is some sort of mind feeling i am this i am adored at all times i am petted by all around me i am something not only for a affluent kid even for a normal ego which is born in a middle class family also moment to moment there is some gathering there is some stiffness gathers around your thought because thought is taken to be something authentic that is me that has become me that has become me all not uh, understood at all by anyone here every one undergoes deep sleep absolute nothingness every one every me there is a state where there is no identification is left with whether it is a male or female or affluent or poor afflicted with lot of diseases terminally ill patient or one who is, who has to face the gallows the next day even he undergoes sleep some moments some hours from some, some hours where there is there is no totally extinction of your personal sector and the animals and the birds and everything in the cosmos they already are in this state they are simply ignorant of it that's all it is it is a sagaja sthiti it is a sagaja sthiti but not aware of by them here we are fully enmeshed in our moment to moment waking state with lot of motives everything is motive trivial to all in your own assumptions a big project of your life and everything is motivated how has this center come to be a center always motivated identifying itself as the body and the possessions it uh, possess coding modifying maneuvering avoiding accepting seeking between these actions there are rules laid out rules by the society this is good this should be sought after this is bad this is right this is wrong this is profitable this is not profitable virtues all the pairs of opposites on the psychological level and on the physical level between those two mangoes you choose the better one it is a physical level right this is a ripened mango it's a good mango it will be sweet avoid this don't take that this all on the physical plane physical plane even choosing colors in our dresses everything is physical the very very moment is filled with this choices be it on the physical or on the psychological out of this uh, within within psychologically one always tries to improve oneself advance oneself no become a knowledgeable person in competition with someone in all the fields all over the world be it in the legal field be it in the economical field 
be it in the any professional field, in anything and everything. Always there is a psychological rat race perpetuated by the center. And the total wealth of this globe is competed, shared, aggrandized by the mighty earth, right? Apart from this, what is our waking state? Looking at a person, there is a comparison, constant comparison. Even by a child, the child looks at the other child, compares on the toy he holds in his hands. Why my father is not able to get this type of toys? So rich in color, so playful, so nice it is, it attracts, it does so many things. Everything is a movement in comparison in the psychological center. What else is our waking state? Where does the reality or uh, seeking something in all this said to be holy? is going to protect some what, what is it, it it is going to protect this setup this is what our prayers are what else is our prayer this setup you are already going on with a lot of motives you are already in competition you pray that that you should fail your competitor should fail nothing else is going to be your prayer right somehow i should be psychologically or physically in my skills or anything i should outsmarting that's all what else will be the prayer and whom are you uh, propping up as a uh, as an agent and praying to it what are you what are our gods are they, in, are, are they not mental projections? Formed mentally, sculpted physically in a rock. In time, it has been attributed with all the powers that you don't have. It possesses by praying to it. It graces you. And where do all these gods and all these personal motives disappear in our own deep sleep state? We are not talking about our physical day-to-day -day security oriented existence. We need money, right? For our sustenance, for our well-being. Is it, is it enough for us? There is something deep down in every one of us that wants to, that is crying, no? If we are if we are simply the animals behaving like animals living like animals with food alone we should have been contented with sex alone we should have been contented with uh, the science uh, security over your health and physical things uh, we should have been contented where is the question of seeking something else at all why it happens why is there all constantly there is a search within or without outside constantly going on no one is uh, no one is having a pacified uh, intellect or a mind no one has that except uh, a few realized souls except a few realized souls what is that they have, that they have seen that has pinched everything
there is a constant fright, fear behind anything and every, everything of our psychological moment. Whether this is right or wrong. My approach is right or wrong. My expression is right or wrong. The result will be favorable or unfavorable for these expressions. Again, all these are only through thoughts, thinking, 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 thinking. Enjoyment is also considered to be thinking. The boha, the bhokta, he is also said to be an entity, an entity inside. There is a constant uh, fear, no? Inherent fear in thoughts, no? It is trying to perfect it. It is trying to bring it under certain perfections, perfected states. As if it is the being, it is the being which is living through the thought. Are we not continuously modifying our own images constantly inside, thereby outside also? Outside is an expression of inside. Inside is the base, basis, the source. And the outside is a reaction, a reflection, nothing else. What am I within is what is, what am I outside also. Not otherwise. Actions follow thoughts. Physical domain is actions. Psychological invisible domain is thinking thoughts. And thinking is I am. I am the thinker. What is that I am? What is this contours? This is what thinks. And the fundamental uh, Insufficiency is the moment, any confinement, be it thought body, thought is also a form. Your, your, your expectation is a clear cut, you are holding it, you are like a bubble, you are carrying it, pantingly you are carrying it, that it should not burst at all in time. That is what are our dreams from. Moment to moment living, what, what is it? It is an illusion, walking in illusions. Our expectations are all the next moment. The physical tomorrow, the physical tomorrow is projected by the psychological thoughts. The physical future is a reflection of the psychological future. Again, what is the psychological future? Everything is thinking. Thought, thought, thought. Contrarily, nothing of this is needed in D3. This whole center with the physical, psychological uh, fright ceases to exist. No one, nothing. Whether it is a dead state or an alive state, to cognize nothing. To be nothing, not to be nothing. Who holds that state? Or in whose hold are we in the state? Who? What is it? The same thing is animating feverishly here. Over issues, over relationships, over things, over money, over power, any kind of power. A small boy talking to his friend, another boy of the same age, I know 
I know how to read that or I know how to repeat that. It is power. It is power. Don't you understand? I understand this problem. This is power in competition. Don't you understand this mathematical problem? A fourth standard boy asking his uh, friend uh, in the same class. Don't you understand this? I have understood this. The same power. Power play. He is terribly confused now. The other one. All our statements now. They don't carry any meaning at all. Be it a children's talk or the grown-ups, so-called grown-ups. They are physically only grown-up. See, if we, if, we, if we do not know what is the psychology, whose is it, why is it, why should I touch that at all, why in the first place thinking happen, Suppose uh, you are buying a very new item, the latest uh, scientific gadget, something you buy. Assume that uh, it is a smart TV with a uh, computer, so many things. Will you simply bounce on it, start using it? What will you try to do first? First of all, what should you do? You should give enough time to your soul to go through physically, then uh, through the brochure, manual, through surfing all the keys externally av available, the buttons, the controls. To put it into optimum use, <coughs> what should you do? What should you do? First, be with yourself. This essentially is not known to anyone at all. Being with oneself, what, what, what will happen? Being with what? Being with oneself is what actually? What is it? I have no nothing. I, I have to go there, uh, get my salary, I have to work there, that's all. What is there in being with me? What is this me? With me, what is it? complete darkness about the software called mind which comes and goes which comes during the waking state it is you it is never uh, the controls are never seen understood what are feelings why are feelings why, why do I register a particular experience? Where does experience register itself? Why at all? Why should I bring it to memory? What safety do I get by registering this? What is that psychological tremor behind the registration? Why am I afraid fundamentally? For all these basic questions, first of all, who are you is the question. No. At any point in the time, I am a mood, I am a thought, I am a feeling, I am a memory, I am a replay of experience or a seeking in the present, doing something in the present, meddling with the present. But who is the meddler? Or who, who is advancing towards what? Who wants what? Who? Wanting what is not important. Who? Essentially who? I have a clear purpose buying a smart TV. 
what is a smart TV? It contains all the internet connect, uh, connections also. Through internet also I can come to the TV world. Right? Apart from working as a simply a TV, it works as an internet also. If some, some time the cable connection is cut, I can use through internet, I can go through all the channels all over the world and see it, exchange emails, do so many things with that. Okay? This is the purpose. Here, we have so many motives, very far-stretched motives, consuming whole of our life, a short-stretched motive, a project, constructing a house, having a, a beautiful wife, uh, children, we getting a children, and everything is planned. In successive stages, uh, trying to be attain some powers. If I join as a manager, then I try to become an assistant general manager, then a deputy general manager, then a general manager, then a MD, executive director, MD. All the stages are all over the world set already. Even before we have come into this scene, in this movie, this grand movie of waking state. Your waking state and my waking state or his waking state do not differ in any manner, right? He has taken himself to be that name and that form, that orientations. You have taken to you have taken yourself to be this form and this gender.